Hello, hello everyone. How are you doing? Hope all is well. I hope you're remembering to take care of your mental health because we need to make that a priority at this time. Never underestimate the pain of a person because in all honesty, everyone is struggling. Some people are better at hiding it from others because sometimes it scores no point telling people what you're feeling or what you're going through. I miss the loss to the reggae and dancehall community of Boom Dynamite who had passed away in the US shortly after arriving on the plane. He was rushed to the hospital but due to complications from a previous car accident in Jamaica that was never treated appropriately, he never made it. And it has sent the whole music fraternity into shock as he was well known. Condolences flow in worldwide. His good friend Bounty Killer, whom Boom Dynamite was responsible for bringing forth his career, broke down in shock as Bounty Killer looked at Boom Dynamite as a true and loyal friend. Boom Dynamite was a part of the Scare Them crew, which consisted of Boom Dynamite, Nitty Kochi, Harry Toddler, and Elephant Man. This group was formed back in the 1990s and was closely aligned to Bounty Killer and generally travel with him on tours which they gained exposure from. Which is one of the reasons Bounty Killer came out on full blast against Elephant Man. As there was no sighting of Elephant Man anywhere, neither reacting are reaching out with condolences on the loss of his close co-worker that was very instrumental in his career. As because of Boom Dynamite there is a Bounty Killer. Because of Bounty Killer there is a Scare Them Crew which Elephant Man derives from and so many others. In Bounty Killer outrage at Elephant Man, lack of emotions, he said Elephant Man is a real animal and he's going to reap what he saw. Even Miss Ivan dead, his mom, and he did not say R.I.P. No feelings or emotion. Ask his children. Nothing surprised me, a wicked youth that. He further said if Boom never bring me go a studio, Elephant Man couldn't bust. I hope him remember that. Elephant Man responded while ignoring what Bounty Killer publicly said about him. He said no one can't tell him how he's feeling and him not embracing no negativity. Elephant Man further stated him hurt, shook up and mash up over Dandemite passing. Because the last time he had heard Dandemite crash and good, then all of a sudden Dandemite passed on. No sir. He said it jerked him up wicked. Elephant Man further stated him not live his life for Instagram or any social media for that matter. And him not live for people. Him only live for the Almighty Creator. He then said what people don't know, he has been on the phone with Dandemite's sister, brother and him daughter and his baby mother and also Dandemite father. And he's also broken up and shocked like everyone else about his death. And further stated he was one of the first person to know of Dandemite when he fell in a coma the Saturday while in Miami. He said Schoenberg call him and he run them off of the phone and said stop chat foolishness. Nothing can go so. Dandemite they are see if you walk okay. here. And all right. As now what day him, him just recover from a crash. He said Sharon Burt then called Papa San and Papa San was there praying over Dandemite. Elephant Man is also the godfather of two of Boom Dynamite daughters. When asked about Bounty Killer's comment on Instagram, Elephant Man said he is really surprised at Bounty Killer's comment. As his silence at first was the shock and grief and he's also busy in Vancouver, Canada, working. And him now looking at hype of his brother, Boom Dynamite, passing. 
So him not have to come public and chat nothing. Cause he don't know where he feel and where he do. Remember, you know, me and him write songs together, you know, we travel together, you know. Me they are firing, me they are boom dynamite, yard are sleeping, you know. It no more shake me up. It's a great loss. As a garden to elephant man. You know something? Sometimes as a people, we rush to judgment. It's not a good thing. As there's also some people that don't do social media a lot. As they really don't understand the whole social media thing. As me myself, most of what I understand about social media is through my children. Because this generation seem like them born ready for technology. I see my children do things with technology, my head spin. So not because people don't don't every breath they take it's on social media doesn't mean they're not living. With all the outpour of love for boom dandamite, it is a true and tragic loss to the reggae and dancehall community. As he was not only an artist, he was a choreographer, he was a writer. He was he helped them to even organize the dress sense. He played many roles. Rest in peace, boom dynamite. You will not be forgotten. Anyway, guys, please remember to like, comment, be respectful to each other, and please subscribe to my platform. Anyway, love you all. Bye for now.